Catholicism. Heard of her? Pump, pageantry, attitude, and man wearing fabulous dresses. We call them PayPal vestments. Now, Franny here is thinking it's time to retire and pass on his tiara. But how's he going to choose a new pope? I want to engage younger people. Make them feel part of the fun. That's why he called me. Because if you want to choose the next Vatican king, honey, you need a queen. First up, Angelo Scola, working a classic Cardinal Lurk. I am giving you Scarlet Red, Scarlet Fever, Scarlet Johansson. I'm serving a statement necklace, and that statement is, I feel papal as hell. This queen's looking to excommunicate the competition. He's from Milano, right? I love their cookies. Scola is a great scholar and a keen promoter of interreligious dialogue. Mm. Next up, Brazilian Cardinal Odilo Scherer. <laughs> Scherer? I don't even know her. I am dusting the runway in this black duster. Christian Dior said black is essential to any wardrobe, and I'm pretty sure he was Christian. It's like Reese Witherspoon. Classic, clean, and no surprises. The church has always been good at cover-ups. Whoa, he just turned water into frosé. I thought this would be more of a liturgical competition. Next up, his eminence, Timothy Dolan, giving us body are are in old school Vatican opulence. I am serving fish during Lent with this look. You know, life begins the conception of this outfit, biatch. Look at that egg on his head. Someone's getting laid. It's a small cock, but I like what he's doing with it. Ow! Ooh, Mia's so culpa. I don't know what made that happen. Oh, Lord, humiliate my competition until I sit on that sweet Pope throne. Hey, you can't pray in here. That's cheating. Ladies, the judges have weighed in. Angelo, I'm sorry, dear. Sashay away. Now, before I make my final decision, it's time for you to lip sync for your eternal life. There must be some way out of this contest. Too late, Pope Francis. I've made my decision. And the winner of RuPaul's Pope race is... Me! Because who else could it be? Please tell me you at least own a Bible. Don't worry, Franny, I can't take the job. I'm still doing Drag Race. And quite frankly, I think it's gonna be around a lot longer than Catholicism. So, bye. Well, I learned something. In nomine Patris et Spiritus Sancti, girlfriend! New James Bond auditions, RuPaul, take one. Hi, bondage queens. I am loving this lurk and working this look. 007, double O, my God. Cut. Which way to pussy galore? Pretty soon, there's bound to be an opening on the Supreme Court, and I gotta move it left, way left. It'll go so left, it'll be tucked between my butt cheeks. I'll explain that to you later, sir. Great, man. I want a legal scholar the kids will like, someone with pizzazz, Razzmatazz. If you're looking to upgrade the court's class and sass, there's only one way to find the perfect nominee. Our first contestant comes to us from the Third Circuit Court of Appeals. Will her ensemble be appealing, or will it get her disbarred? I'm serving a Babylonian style from the original lawmaker, King Hammurabi. Eye for an eye, tooth for a tooth, bitch. And do not touch my beard extensions. Old school justice. Republicans will love her, but she's a no sale to Dems. Are those papyrus scrolls real? Because that would freak me out. Our next lawyer is known for her legendary oral. Arguments. 
I'll explain that one later. I got that one. I've been on trains. I'm dishing Good Shepherd of the Constitution. You expect a nomination for that? Don't count your sheep, little hoe peep. <laughs> But also, she's an expert on the Commerce Clause. Next up, a real twist. She tips the scales of justice with this fishy realness. Come through, Bio Queen. Ooh, honey, they say justice is blind, and your outfit proves it. You shouldn't rush to judgment, because I'm no believer in judicial restraint. It's a reveal! I'm gagging for it! I think this queen may reign supreme. <laughs> Help! Secret Service! The dog's got me! <laughs> My motion was denied. I was tripped. Overruled. I will not stand for contempt of court. You're dismissed. I swore I wasn't going to cry, but I'll allow it. <laughs> it's time for our final contestants to lip sync for your life. Time appointment to the Supreme Court. Cue Samuel Alito's opinion in the case of Collins v. Yellen. Because the Federal Housing Finance Agency, FHFA, did not exceed its authority under the Housing and Economic Recovery Act of 2008 as a conservator of Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac, the anti-injunction provisions Stop of- Stop the opinion. I know who our nominee should be. He, she, they, you have been here all along. Me? You've had to make the hardest and most important decisions for years. Which fella looks like a dame? I sentence us all to a life of eleganza. <laughs>